Hey guys, welcome to Hike in the Hills. Uh, a couple of things before we get going here. Uh, we're still... <laughs> Bruh, you have no idea how frustrated I am with this. Um, you know, accidentally clicked the button. It is a thing. Um, yeah. So, um, B car here, gonna be giving you guys the hike in the hills thing. Waiting for the map to change. And then uh, we'll get going with what's going on here. Should be fun. Uh, we are on vanilla because apparently, um, the, well, the increased pace of here we go getting a map change now so we'll go into what hiking the hills is in a second the um increased pace of patches to the game breaks all mods did you know um, especially ours um and not able to fix that so we are on a vanilla layer today using our backup server. Uh, but the operation is still gonna go pretty much as planned. Some kit exchanges here. We won't have some custom kits like the ammo bearers. So riflemen will have ammo bags, I think. Not entirely sure, uh, but we will see shortly. Hike in the Hills is a patrol operation for US. And uh, just to tell you what, just to see what that looks like here. Since I get to admin cam, I have to wait for the match to start. Very cool. Uh, we'll just go ahead and show you this. The um, operations like this, US are going to start in one of three locations. We are going to have a helicopter today. Very cool. U.S. starts in one of three locations, and they're going to roll to find, sort of based on where they're going to go, INS are going to be reacting to this patrol. There is, a, uh, there is an INS main on this layer, so I don't think the uh, western side of the AO is going to be in play very much. I believe we're going to see more of the uh, line over to the central part of the map here. So literally based on the document, uh, U.S. don't know where they're going. U.S. have a start point. I think U.S. gets their first patrol point off live. And that's it. They get fed all the other points as they proceed. Uh, the, uh, the event admin is going to generate everywhere where these guys are going. Uh, INS have some start locations. I believe they have to spread those guys around. They can start up to two squads at uh, a couple of locations. Get a little admin slow-mo here as everything kicks off. So, just to get people where they need to go. So that's why I see the clouds go by really fast there. There is a gossip mechanic here. Uh, INS may receive intel on where the um, US forces are going to go. So, based on a die roll, INS will either get the start location for US forces, the first patrol point, the second or third or the final patrol points, or if the roll is a six, INS will receive all US patrol points. U.S. will have to do a five-point patrol. So 
starting from, I would presume, is going to be the south of the north. We do have a helicopter pilot today. Phoenix, our uh, SOT manager, the guy who's in charge of uh, bringing, or sort of, not really, um, but the guy who's in charge of all of the uh, the training and how we do basic in the community and how everyone is brought up to speed as far as joining the community. As far as um, players that want to participate in our operations are concerned. Those, um, all of those things, he's in charge of that. He'll be flying a helicopter today. So he'll be flying for both US teams. And we're going to be following US for this operation. Uh, loadouts uh, that we have available uh, minus some of these specific ones and there's also going to be no command support since we are on a, on a, um, a vanilla layer uh, but there are going to be six ARs, four lats, two mini machine guns I believe four, I don't know if we have breachers actually we don't uh, so those last two platoon level rules may be different. There's also two MRAPs being given out here. And the final patrol point is going to be establishing a FOB. Um, based on the document, those FOBs are going to be two times HMGs and uh, fortifications. For INS... There are going to be some changes as well. Uh, each squad is two ARs, one medic. And the platoon cache is eight lats, two sappers, unlimited raiders. And I can't check INS kits, but I believe... Uh, sappers, raiders may be different. Not entirely sure to see how that goes they do get two well, actually they won't get two drones because we aren't using command support we are in a vanilla operation today so that's what we've got coming up today for hiking the hills here we go we're gonna listen to morgan now yep yes yep excellent excellent so uh Command has given us a uh, very interesting assignment today. I know we've been kind of just hanging out here at this fob, not really doing a whole lot. So uh, he's he's going to be utilizing us in uh, in our typical capacity, which is uh, aircraft. So we are going to be hopping in this uh, whirly bird and going to the various positions marked on the map. Squad four is going to be in uh, India five. Squad two is going to be in Juliet five, and squad one is going to be in Lima six. We have an objective here. Uh, we've got a, a variety of different um, mission sets that may come about tonight, but essentially this is a patrol and a react combat. So um, we're gonna have a number of different objectives we're gonna have to go to all across uh, Kohat tonight. First point being Juliet 6, uh, 3, 5, specifically that compound there. We've heard there could be some shady dealings going on, perhaps a bomb maker, perhaps uh, you know, just a couple locals working on their motorcycles. We're not sure yet, so we need to go and investigate and potentially eliminate anybody that's there. Again, the way we're going to do that is by inserting via heli to those three locations marked. And um, Alpha Guido will be bringing up Squad 3 with the Matt Vs to secure the location, while Squads 2, 4, and 1 provide overwatch in the surrounding areas. After that is done, we're going to have um, another location we'll have to go and... Uh, take a look at uh, we don't know what it is yet command still uh taking a look at his uav and trying to see what uh what he wants us to do so we'll get that um we'll get that mission as we get a little further on tonight what um what this is going to entail is uh movement by heli and movement by foot so be aware keep your eyes up keep engaged if you see things out of the helicopter such as enemy patrols in the area you know you see a guy on a motorcycle with an id strapped to it Call those things out. Let us know. Um, there's a number of military-age males in this area. 
Uh, make sure that you notate all of them to your SL so you can pass it up the chain of command. And uh, hopefully you guys have a good time tonight. I'm going back in one piece. Do I have any questions? I'll take that as a no. Excellent. All right, break them out. Let's get ready for life. And we're live. And Phoenix still in admin cam. There we go. There it goes. So, Mad Fees are going to roll out first. And Phoenix is going to spin up the helicopter. Attempt anything on quicksand. True. Like, I've streamed, done commentary, commanded. Um, I have fun with it. I don't think people in watching have fun with it. Um, I've done squad leading while streaming. I don't like a squad, a squad lead because it is a lot of things to carry on. You have to watch, you have to listen to command, you have to listen to your guys, you have to shoot things. And on top of all that, you have to uh, be relatively good at the game. All right, so nobody here, they moved, those guys moved off to point four. And we're seeing insert. How great would it be if he got a shot off from here and that guy just jumped out like a dummy? And people run into the rotor blades. That's, uh, that's what you get. For not having situational awareness with a helicopter. Oh, oh guess what? <laughs> oh, I missed that. Oh, no. <laughs> Lat. Squad 2 is wiped out. Phoenix, land the remainder of the squads on the um, east side. Oh, no. Lat rocket from JKR we'll takes... Takes out five. Because they just sat there. Squad two, need to get you out of the valley. Need to get you out of that valley. Uh, that was the helicopter. They walked into the helicopter blade, is what killed those two guys. And then Orange and JKR just threw a rocket, a frag rocket, straight in these guys that were just sitting there. I. Push, push east. Alright, there we go. R2 figured out that he needs to roll now. Squad four. Heard another rocket get fired. Helicopter's coming back. I thought friendly vehicles don't damage in this game. You are wrong. They have always damaged in this game. 100%. Rotor blades have always been a lethal problem. The first week helicopters came out, we had a hot drop. Uh, we did an operation where there's a hot drop, and then um, everyone jumped out, but everyone jumped out all at the same time. So the problem was everyone was getting spawned on top of each other. The more people that would spawn in, the more people would jump into the helicopter blades. Queso Blanco 
Uh, your squadly wasn't able to react in time, but you could have uh, respond. You could have been revived, and then you guys got shot by a, a rocket. So maybe not. Um, No, vehicle, ground vehicles will run you over and they don't do damage. Helicopters... <laughs> helicopter blades are different. High and low, guys. High and low. Don't let somebody below us kill us. Army, get your guys to you can get run over all day and ragdolled. Two that are not in your squad anymore, back to your squad and respawn me. Really? Yes. Uh, directive from EA, you guys are going to respawn. Oh, another another team kill? Wow. If any of your guys are dying to fucking helicopter insert, uh, allow them to, you know, be revived. And also make sure you stop having... Bartok sees something all the way over here. Little bit tattooed right here. Oh, they see that. Yup, good hits, good hits. Squad four. Two hundred meters. Good hits, good hits. Let's get those map bees uh, with you. Nice, good, good hits. And assist. Reloading. Uh, there is no uh, enemy proximity chat, so it's not like postscriptum. Your discretion as to where you want to put them. I just want some. Okay. Copy. Oddball is talking an AR on the target here. Oh, one. On target. Fire over there. Good shots. Charlie, I want you guys to assist Bravo. Reposition us to stay. I don't believe anyone will come up behind us. Four, where are you taking the contact from? Very long range engagements here. US have got to get moving. 50 caliber. Possible techie. Want me back up Copy. Can we don't see if you can get our, our map view to get an eye on that. I can Light see it up. into the town 160 if that's what we're trying to observe on. Uh, Commander, are we, uh, this is actually kind of perfect. Rocket. I'm, I'm looking for. You yes. Overshot. So they are shooting rockets at range here. They're just yeeting those things. Command, I think I'm dead on where you want one. Correct. Um, land them in the valley. Kilo 5. Could hit Audacity here. That would be very bad. Kilo 695, somewhere around that area. Uh, let's fly over to the INS side of things and see what we can see about how they're maneuvering. Largely turning to face, but there's only two squads really doing anything right now. Squad two and some of squad three has Overwatch. Need you guys. Light patrols. Securing it. Rocket shot. Short. around the uh, patrol point, we could probably send an element in there right now and secure it. Two contracts, infantry, K6, 44. Copy. Send uh, Frost. Command. These guys are just very cautiously hiding out the back here. They're all the gossip dice thingy yet. I would assume that was done without our knowledge. We don't have access to INS command comms. Ooh. 50 cal getting pretty close there. Polo's got to get out of there. Another shot. Short. Um, I want you holding that intersection. Get to some good cover if you can. And Phoenix is inserted. Looks like a third squad now. So the helicopter's going to roll out.
Are they shooting at the... Maybe that's just tracers going all the way over to the southeast. So Phoenix is just going to provide overwatch now. Get intelligence. Squad 4 requesting permission to move up. Absolutely. Move at your discretion, 4. And we do have... Copy. We do have a Matt V's rolled straight for the first objective. Compound will be reported as clear very shortly. Clear. Don't go out there. Don't go out there. Oh, stationary target. Very good opportunity to get a kill here. Ewok is just sitting here. Let's hop in, guys. I got, I got a grenadier or somebody shooting at me. India 776. India 776. Copy. Last chance. India 776 is the next objective. Let me see if I can figure out if they rolled the gossip die or not. Squad four, remain where you're at for now. Nope. Um, you guys are gonna not going to be able to. Until, um, Heli is able to come pick you I think one of the admins is also squad leading. So. Copy. Rocket. Landing closer and closer. That one actually would have taken out some people earlier. Some people, yeah. There were definitely people sit. There were definitely U.S. Uh, sitting right here. That would have been bad. Command, just a heads up. The heli took fire from around the Hangu uh, point, so just just some intel. Copy. Thank you for the intel. Hangu point. It's a real town. What was that grid for the point? India seven. Ooh. <laughs> the prone. Okay. Stand by. Looks like transport's coming in. To uh, form up with the rest of our squad. Correct. Two. Scuba Rob, Uvenis, Hood, and Koba are running forward here. Pretty exposed. Where's Koba think he's going? Be advised, we have a buddy team of enemy infantry, Hotel 635, firing lats into Squad 1. Be aware as you're moving up to that point to secure at one. You do have enemy infantry. All right, so Orange JKR, fresh off of getting their kills on the helicopter deposited troops, are rolling to potentially the next objective. I think they're trying to get some elevation here. India 776, this is the next patrol point. I believe it's uh, this hill. Two-man fire team, they're fleeing on a motorcycle, heading northwest. Be advised. JKR a little lost here. Realizes he's... Maybe he's uh, just trying to hide in the shelf here. Another lat. Looks like they actually took some damage here. I'd like you to pick up squad four and leapfrog them um, somewhere east of this point that we're going to, India 776. I'm sorry, west of the point. Maybe perhaps around Golf 772 or uh, Hotel 687. INS firing rockets like their life depends on it. Command, will you identify the point? Point is India 776. 
I would like those guys northwest or southwest of that point. Uh, move at your discretion. Two, this is command. Yep. Just confirming you guys are moving up to uh, reform. Uh, yes, Roger. We're currently trying to get up for the hill. Uh, we're skylining, but it's the only way to get up. Copy. Five, four, five's landed. Load up. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> Alright, uh, break, try to reverse or just turn left. Man, this is fine. Four, this is dead <laughs> Bartok's in the turret. <laughs> should be good, should be good. Climb. Alright, I'm gonna get out. We, we can't reverse a bit how far west east. west. And then You're like oh, you almost had it. Oh, and you lost it. Alright, there we go. Command, this is, uh, I'm sorry. One, this is command. Go for one. You walk and hashling and slasher. Loitering here. Okay, we do have the second point fulfilled. So we got to secure radio tower next. Radio tower, here we come. This is going to be the big fight. You are the to I the would think. Um, if you wouldn't mind. JKR and Orange still lo it's still hanging out. They're looking for people to shoot. Three, um, you've got the MRAPs, you're a little more mobile. If you could perhaps move on into the Kilo 8, Kilo 9 grid square area. I don't think they know they're over this hill. fire from that area. Helicopter flying over. Stand by. You got any lats? You got any lats orange? You got any lats orange? You got any lats orange? JKR, you got any lats? You had your chance. Oh yeah, that's a square on hit. Phoenix is burning up. Hershey had to drop out. I think the helicopter may be donezo. There's a square on hit in the compartment. I think it's going to bust. He's got to land that thing now. Yep, he's going down. He's going to crash hard. Great shot by JKR. And there we go. Rough. How was the pressure on, um... The guys that took the first point could have had observation on that, but, uh... All that being said, the, the team that Phoenix inserted actually made it in fine. Um... We could take a look from where all that contact happened. These guys got dropped off... Uh, where am I? I losing my mind here? You can start maneuvering south of your position. They got shot right over here. So Makes sense to put them in the big open area, uh, and it just the bushes. Two, I'd also like you to start they just were able to climb the hills and get the elevation they needed to to make that shot. Roger that. Which means now they have to rely. They can't rely on the helicopter anymore. They have to go with the. The ground MRAPs. They only have two of them. Or sorry, the Mad Vs. That was rough. Okay, I see, uh... And here we go. This is the big concave that Ines had been forming for a hot minute. And they're waiting for it. Around Malakabad, plus the radio tower here. Radio tower is here. Malakabad here. Looks like we've got several mines down here. If you stand exactly where I'm standing, you can see them. Don't stand up, though. Our IEDs, actually. Very, very crazy. Because I got guys right now. 
I got and we have uh, contact at range. Matt V also engaging now. Two guys, careful. I'm gonna roll us slowly. Well, those guys actually got hit. Sounds good. Smart to keep the vehicle moving, at the very least. Uh, what happened to command? So, somebody ran me over with an MRAP, and uh, I got launched through the stratosphere. Oh. He ran me over with the tire. Okay. God damn it. Are you, are you going to be coming down any point soon? I am under the map, so at some point... Uh, yeah, he fell through the map. Spawn spot on main, just grab a grab another MRAP and just drive it up back to where Commander you're. has been reassigned. Let he quit. I oh, know he's respawning, I think. It'll take a minute for Morgan to get back here though. Uh we got close contact here as squad one makes it up the radio hill. Shots across the uh, eastern valley. There goes Curry. Got shot off as he was skylining. Big oof at range. Still plenty of people. Silent and elusive look like they're still engaging to their northeast. Not sure what they're shooting at from here. Rocket. Looks like hit square on the, uh, someone shot a rocket square on the radio tower. Might have been miscommunication from INS. INS not defending radio tower pretty strongly here. Steve having, having to run away. And it looks like INS are actually making a mass retreat here. Evito. Does he have his eyes open? No, he doesn't. He's looking up the hill instead of to his right. To oh, buddy. Look le look right, please. Look right, please. Bong, look right, please. <laughs> Ron, what's contact looking like up there? Wow. And now they're going to get shot in the back. Northwest, northwest, northwest. Get, get over here, Bong. It's coming from northwest. An entire INS fire team just runs out in the open and isn't spotted by anyone. So they are falling back to the backside of Radio Tower. Maybe INS thinks the Radio Tower is an objective. Copy. They have to push past Radio Tower. Linus doing a decent job of keeping U.S. under constant pressure. Current areas. Um, Although I haven't seen the SPG techie used yet. Where's that at? Um, I, I, it's been trending it's so over here in the south. Continuing further south. Gonna go high, you stay low, Doug. Rocket. That. Fire towards... Uh, I'm guessing it was moving towards the MRAP or the Mat V up here. Stationary target, no longer stationary. Hey, break, break four. You got contact at Looks like they are trying to shoot up there, but it's not going to do anything. First Mat V now on the road. Any minds to watch out for? Looks like there's one. He just placed it. Probably the guys have been chasing for a little while. INS do get uh, AT mines. One, let me know when that uh, location is clear. Radio tower is clear. So let's go back here. U I, uh, US's push is pretty coherent. It's nice and wide. Everyone is on point now, and even the radio tower has been captured. But the problem is, INS have about a squad size force in the back rank here, and radio tower is more guarded off. Uh, there's about a whole squad off the radio tower waiting for US to take the position. Where's that? 
and they're still getting pinged from range. It's the rear rank guys are actually shooting here. Northeast. Great moves from INS. Once we engage far east and far west. Along until the skyline. Ah, <laughs> uh, rocket comes in. Oh shit. What the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> and the south guys are now engaging the radio tower directly. Hood gets hit. These guys are now really out of support. They really can't move. They have to engage the south forces so they can break out. They can break a direction. No more helicopter. They don't have no idea what is happening. And look at these guys, they're just waiting for the next chance to engage here. And a rocket goes up and in, and El Vito is erased. There goes Hood. Rocket hits the radio tower. Frag rockets being used to great effect as Juvenus and Bong have to run away. Two U.S. down on the radio tower. And Polish got spotted somehow. Copy. Meanwhile, Zach and the Cheese Man are just chilling out and skylighting on this part of the hill here. No one is marking them. Polish is hiding, looking for these guys, but he's not going to find them from his position. Three. Meanwhile, the MRAP is now providing a bit of ability to draw some fire. Ooh, that was a grenade. That, was, that might have been the SPG techie. Oh, that was an 80. I think that was SPG or rockets. All the technicals over there. This is a bad situation. That is command for INS. He just got hit. Charlie, look left with me. Look uh, west. Command, we have contacts in building H995 for PH9. There's a dish getting engaging now. I believe that's an SPG. Yeah, a little bit longer. Oh, there's a Dishka. It's the armored Dishka techie. Matt V doesn't look like it was hit there. Now taking rounds. Great dodge there by the Matt V. Front lines haven't really changed in the last five minutes. Linus still holding Malak, still holding off the radio tower. U.S. starting to put some more effort into taking the top of the radio tower now. Oh, Bong dies. He gets shot up through the through several walls. It looks like. Kanan Casey actually has a brilliant position here on the back of that hill. How far? Um, I think Ewok is still dealing with people over here to the east. Is it on the ridge or in the valley? It's right now, I have no targets. In the ridge. It's like Dudeson just gone down in the field here. Uh, let's take a look at the scoreboard real quick, see if we can get a fix on how we're doing. One and two down to half strength, four down to half strength. 
About 10 casualties. Ines, can't tell. Can't tell about Ines casualties for some reason. Thanks, scoreboard. Appreciate you. U.S. operating at about two and a half squads, or maybe more like three squads. They also don't have the helicopter right now. Dishka is also engaging. These guys are eating frag rockets. It's the SPG. The SPG techie. Nashville's just lobbing frags over here at these guys. Someone Someone's down. Taking heavy suppressive fire at the hill of I-9. R2 goes down, shot from the backside of Radio Tower, where INS are still holding. Oh no, SPG. The SPG could seriously screw these guys up right now. It's only us, I think. And, but it looks like they are moving. Uh, take cover if you can, we just got shot at by a lot. Um, it's still men in the SPG though. South. Uh, it's command's orders. We really need to uh, get the fuck out of here. Uh oh. Google friggin' died. Somehow, Alpha, th I guess maybe Alpha threw a grenade and it killed a friendly. I don't think there's any really way to tell that uh, <laughs> I was over there. A lance square on hits the Mat V and it's rolling. It's lost its front left. Still taking fire. That is the SPG. Radio tower squarely under control now. There's the, uh, ma that's the Dishkateki. Don't park that right next to me. Getting shot from the west, study. Someone give me a direction. I'm hit, I'm hit. My FTLs. If I go down, you've lost command cops with my I'm squad. Hit, hold yes, we are. Ewok has to bandage. Matt V abandoned. Discoteki is opening up more fire on the Mad V. Looks like the north push is pretty much dissolved for US. Yeah. Nothing going on up there. He walk virtually in a way. Anybody want to spot me? Do you matter a time for the uh, M map? The map V gets popped here. SPG now also trying to open up on the map V here. About a squad size up. Explosion coming in. It's a bit far off, far away. They're currently moving west of our position. I'm glad I got the ammo off that Copy. thing at least. Very shortly it will pop. Overshot from the SPG there. Using our push here to get to that yeah, there's no one in the north. Fire team plus size strength behind. Fire team south in the river. Two squads operating on the uh, west side of the AO right now. Uh, we can sweep to the next point. So much smoke coming in, I don't think they can get a solid hit. Koba actually gets nailed by that uh, SPG round. Bumper. What's the bearing on these don't, guys? Don't waste it, waste it. INS in a very comfortable position. All of their major artillery is across the river. To break off from that, head back up the river or something, or maybe cross the river. I'm on the next point right now. We are currently pinned down. We can't. We're st we need to push towards your position. There's only two of you left, so do the best you can. Break, break, break. Two. Yeah, contacts close. To oh, you already know. Never mind. Army Soul All right, one, actually pushed through with Schizophrenic and Silent and Elusive. Elusive actually gets gunned down from Patrick Star. Silent running straight towards Army Soul here. 813, Hotel 813. 
And Silent just nails them both. The next objective is called Hotel 813. <laughs> Malakabad. <laughs> that is bad news. US operating about two and a half squads now. Plus one vehicle still operational. Technically they could still move this one, but I wouldn't. INS have now looks like pulled back west. Maybe I just don't see those guys in the northeast because I'm too far away. Another SPG shot. Square on, Scuba Rob is dead. Polish Serb takes a big hit here. Maybe Lats coming in as well? Ina supplies might be running low. Command, we our contacts to our east. They're all spread out. Recommend we group up and just do a big... Oh, there's still a fire team plus size force. You can see them firing from here. Pretty accurate fire. Yeah, it's squad plus, or it's fire team plus. Maneuvering. It was Hotel 813, correct? Hotel 813. Bad news for US forces. They're going to have to go straight to Malakabad. Guys, there's a mortar truck 240. Oddball on the gun. Two thirds up the hill. Two thirds up the hill. 240. Probably just about. Maybe half. I'm gonna fire. I need to have another look. Adjust me. Oh. Nashville dies trying to hide behind the body of that truck didn't help. But that's the SPG truck out of commission, I believe. I think Ines still have their armored techie. Yep. Free arm, free arm over here. Oh, man. There's contacts that are north yeah, yeah, yeah. and east of the region. Anyone that. Oh, I see. Oh yeah, cool. I, I uh, saw the end result of that. You were kind of by yourself. And there was one guy over there. Oh, interesting. They have thrown the, uh, the techie. They threw the ticket into the compound. I... Oh, he's actually trying to shoot Patrick Star and Ewok. Patrick Star barely has sight on him. Alright, Patrick Star, there's your chance. He put his bipod down. Great shot. Berserker down on the gun. Not able to react in time. Should have just got off it. Meanwhile, hello, Killer J. Killer J is rolled into the point. Killer J shooting Javi. Hey, be they roll in. It's just bus driver man staying to Han the Hun. Han the Hun in this building here. Grenades. Ashley and Slasher's dead. Juventus and Koba. Well, the only ones. Uh, let's see, Polish, Juventus, Koba, Killer J, and Alpha still up. Combat turtle running through. West. Bus driver man Stan uh, basically holding the w west side of the compound. Don't know, don't know. Yeah. Go, 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 go
Northside Hotel 827. Honda Hun backed into the building. And a trade. Morgan. Morgan, we don't need to push. Oh, ID. ID, ID, ID. Alpha, combat, Koba. All dead to the ID. Morgan survives. Your Venice and Polish survived. There was a three chain IED that killed everyone there, I think. We have a disc attacky. We have a techie of some sort maneuvering on our south side. EA, I need my uh, bill drop here, please. Is this the last point of the patrol? If so, that means they have to defend Malakabad against all comers. And US don't have the strength for that. Here. Four, I want a buddy team on the INS are making a move real strong here. I think this is the armored technical. Uh, the uh, yeah, this is the armored technical. If you can swing up. INS making preparations to make this push happen. They got a squad coming from across the river now starting to come in. The only other coherent group for our US that's off the point right now is Hershey. And they hear this technical. They see the technical now rolling up. They're taking shots at the gunner. Oddball has got to make the shot. Viking Gaming on the back. They are throwing all the rounds he can to try to get the gunner off the turret. Missing. Toaster dodging bullets. So I'm built different. <laughs> I've survived a few of those. Hey. There's a techie on the Not south side on the road, south side of here. Little pundit spots oddball. Not medic base still. Meanwhile, Javi has made it all the way up to the point and uh Ewok is trying to knock down trying to make sure he doesn't knock on the door. I think Javi's gonna hand throw a grenade. Yep, but uh, misses. Ewok runs away. Killer J is watching the front from inside the compound and interior room. Targets from the southwest to the northwest. Meanwhile, Matt Honcho and the rest of the guys all the way wrapped from the east, wrapped north, and they're now coming in down to the west side. Where we spotted the Grenade! 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 Captain Morgan gets hit by a grenade that was thrown inside the compound blind. Morgan dead, there's no fob going down. Unless Killer J gets out of the building that he's in. I'm dead. Uvenis heats a grenade. Ewok does some mad lad shit, comes out from around, puts two bullets into Javi. Javi, very strong, fights back. The Viking's gonna try to throw this technical up the thing. Meanwhile, the entire guys from the north are now infiltrated the compound from the northwest side. It's just Bartok holding off over here. Bartok puts maybe a bullet into Sasa, but INS have control of the compound now. Killer J's gone, no one else is around. I think Ewok just died. It's just Bartok, and Bartok's taking problems here. He's traded a bullet with Inky. Liberal is throwing a grenade this way. Overthrown. Bartok has to bandage in the middle of a gunfight here. Meanwhile, Hershey's guys are still having problems. Bartok back in the compound. And he's gonna go in the double the two-story building. How the fuck did I survive that? The true story. Hershey's guys still coherently together and Cartel is down over here. They gotta make their way north. Is Basket of Puppies actually up? He's actually up. Bartok and uh, looks like Thanosaurus trade inside the compound though. So Basket of Puppies closest US to the point. Inus have retaken the point. Contact over there in the south, but basket of puppies running past Sasa. Sasa hears him and guns him down. 
INS have full control of the point now, and it's just five men left for U.S. Dealing with Alkaline in the rear, they're trying to push forward. Uh, Crockett comes in, Oddball and Hershey have to back off. 100 meters, RPG. It's a bit further than 100 meters, my friend. Get in the building, we're defending. That's not going to work for long. Hershey's going to get ordered to move here in a bit. Bush this time of year. <laughs> Alkaline making this play. Great job of using the smoke as a distraction. And he doesn't know it, but he's got a great way to approach. But I think he's ran out of rockets. He gets gunned down as it uh, looks like Zero Minus took him out as he's running through. Even throwing a grenade for measure. Kobe. That was bad. The silence got these guys dead to rights. As soon as he figures out he can shoot into a building. Yep, that's exactly what's happened. Oddball takes cover internally here. Ines content to hold the position. Now US getting the push. Ines have retaken. It is now an attack mission for US. 5v looks like... 12. It's just silent on the opposite ridge line, causing problems for them. Now rockets coming in. Oddball and Hershey pushing. Everywhere. Yeah, you're back, brother. Thank you. I'm with you, Oddball. I'm with you, Oddball. Hershey pushing with Oddball independently. They're going to have to push into the open here. Silent is going to take some pot shot. No, Silent has foliage blocking him. I think even Silent is now moving in. The rest of the guys are still getting more ammo. This is about as best chance as Hershey and Oddball are going to get. JKR actually is still across the river as well. Bouncing outrun. Oh no, they pushed overland. Toaster's gone. An INS firing line. Zero minus a suppressed bow, but he's got a grenade to respond with, and he throws it right in the great direction, but I think it's going to bounce past him. Bouncing outrun eats a grenade of his own. Zero minus is going to throw another one up there, see what he can get. Oddball and Hershey have pushed to the north side of the compound now. They're going to come in northwest. There goes check. Lagar should have been watching. Lagar trades with Hershey. Oddball gets another one. Grenade thrown. Overthrown. Bounces. Sasa still outside the compound. Oddball gets a third. Rex Leon going down. Another nade, another nade. Back up, back up. That's me. Oddball throws one in. Zero minus. Vikings down. They could actually do it. Sasa up the hill. Zero minus bleeds out, but Sasa gets a bullet in him by a. It's Oddball. Still running inside like a madman. Only, let's see, three inside the compound right now. Oddball actually getting shot from somewhere. He's trying to shoot through the window at liberal. He's going to throw a grenade in. Oddball gets tagged from the front by Sasa. Liberal eats that grenade, doesn't realize it's been thrown. Sasa runs straight up the front door, but Oddball's got a bandage. Yeah, Nashville, you did pretty good with the SPG there. Sasa knows exactly where Oddball went, and Audacity's waiting for him. No, he turns around at the wrong time. And Sasa misses every single bullet he shot out of that gun. I was punching. Remarkable. Audacity lives by sheer luck. Looks like we had JKR and Silent coming up from the south. Train. 2v5. Dipaka still off point. Javi upstairs. Matt Honcho watching the east side connecting building. Silent JKR still off to the south. Oddball Audacity have to clear this compound. Uh, do southeast. We need to go around. They're going to be on the east side of the compound. Yeah. The longer they wait, the more that Oddball is going to be stuck here. Silent might have him lined up here if Oddball peeks out. Let's take a look from this angle. Silent actually moving now. Silent might have eyes on this front door, but I... Barely. 
JKR is gonna have a much better position, so Silent's gonna move. Intense cinematic music. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go. Southeast, rotating uh, around. Watch it come through that doorway. <laughs> as soon as I fucking leave it. Matt Honcho has got a pretty tight angle here, and Anpal is not going to expect this window. Oh, but Matt Honcho misses the first. I'm pulling back for a second. In the billet room, do east, do east, do east, do east. JKR and Silent okay. still looking for an uh, angle on this front door. Oddball is looking for this window. Matt Honcho moves back. I think he might try peeking it again. That's exactly what happens, and he puts a few bullets at Oddball. How fucking deed. And... Oddball not looking right. Forgets the door is there. Audacity, last man. Silent and uh, JKR are still off point. Matt Honcho is feeling himself here. Looks like he's going to go in. Javi actually comes down from the second story north side. And he's going to cut off this eastern uh, courtyard. He's making a real strong push here, actually. Javi gets caught by Audacity outside the door. Matt Honcho and... Uh, where's the other guy? Wasn't there another guy? Oh, he's actually wrapped all the way around. Depaka actually could have walked in behind Audacity here. Doesn't look like that's gonna happen. Matt Honcho comes out the door shooting. Audacity goes down and that is GG. <laughs> Round one ends with a pretty solid INS victory. Great tactics all around. All right, we're gonna listen to the brief here and I'm gonna... Yep, here we go. ...was very interesting. It, it was cinematic for sure, but there was a lot of unknowns, a lot of flexibility, a lot of miscommunication, and ultimately you guys still did effective work. So thank you so much. Anyone who died early, this is your chance for retribution. Uh, overall, I was very pleased with the, the combat effectiveness, the communication at the SL levels between each other, and I hope that translated to you guys having good experience. Uh, we have a handful of new guys, as you guys noticed in round one. Uh, I got a new guy, his name's Curry right here. He joined halfway through round one, uh, joining late, and uh, he was able to spawn in. He got killed in the first couple of minutes of being in. He's here for retribution in round two. Let's make sure everyone has a good time, and let's listen to our SLs. Starting off with round two, we are going to be taking India 1288. This is our first waypoint given to us by High Command. As you notice, there's a lot of open ground between here and that location, so we're going to be sending the Mat Vs in front. They're going to secure the area, allow our infantry to come in behind them. It's going to be Inky and Matt Honcho's Mat Vs. Um, as those Mat Vs say it's clear, infantry will start to push up. Um, that'll be all based upon discretion of those Mat Vs and what they see, so listen to yourselves. We're going to have our pilot here, Phoenix, is going to drop Utopian Squad, Squad 2, in behind enemy lines up here on helicopter mark. You guys will be alone. You will be cut off. There will be no reinforcements. If you die, you stay dead. We will attempt to come and close that distance between you with our map Vs to provide cover. Utopian Squad is going to come up behind enemy lines and try to disrupt uh, the enemy insurgents and whatever ambushes they have planned. If we find those... Uh, that Utopian squad is better suited elsewhere, we'll pick them back up. If we find that they have a really good foothold, we will ferry more infantry to Utopian's position as needed. Either way, we're going to be moving as a platoon, so that means 360 as you move. Make sure you know where you're going to go to cover if you start getting shot at. If your SL tells you that you are base of fire, that means you start firing back. If your SL tells you you are to take cover and reposition, don't stop and fire. Just take cover and reposition. The key thing is listen to your SLs and FTLs. Is there any questions pertaining to the op at this time? All right, awesome. We don't know our next waypoint. Once we get to India 12, we're going to get our next waypoint. It is critical that you don't backseat your FTLs or SLs. That All right, right uh, let's... Let's go and break them out. Your SLs you know, know how many what vehicle you you'll be in. Uh, negative. All right, let's break it All out. Right. Everyone get ready for live. Weapons check. Worst vehicle controls. It's just friction, man. It's uh, it's just friction. We're live for round two. Hike in the hills. Patrick. Looking for a shot here. We got infantry rolling out. He wants to take a frag rocket shot immediately. Command six, Eagle two taking off. Copy. Good luck. 
Looks like he wants to take a frag rock shot immediately. He's switching out the rounds. He's not gonna... He's gotta get closer to find these uh, vehicles. What's he gonna do? At this point, he's gonna probably wait for them to get out of main and probably throw a rocket at him. He's got AT. Is he gonna try to hit these guys? He's gonna lose his chance. Not the best position to shoot from. Yeah, he's lost his chance to shoot his uh, rocket. And you switch back to frag. Maybe he wants to shoot these infantry as they roll up. Bartok has got a better position up here. I think he sees all the infantry and he's calling Patrick over to him. Patrick looking to move over. Uh, Nashville using all chat. Very sad. Yeah, it's pretty realistic, I think. I mean, like, it's dirt roads, man. Nothing's paved around here except for the actual, like, main road. The, that main road over there is the only thing that's paved, I think, on this map. Maybe some of the back roads on the west side. That's about it. Uh... U.S. on the first objective, and looks like Patrick Starr missed his chance to fire a rocket at infantry. So Bartok and Patrick are gonna roll out. This is one. One MRAP and scout team reports zero enemy activity at the crossroads. Do we proceed with the MRAPs? So we do have a, uh, a technical over here. Make sure that we have Looks like the motorcycle's rolling to find a different place to shoot from. Lots of vehicle activity in the north. Helicopter also placed in the north now. Has dropped off these guys over here on the west side. Or the, yeah, the east side, sorry. Utopian squad. Fox Tot 1036, this is crazy patrol route. It's going to plop them straight in the valley here. Lots of opportunities for this SPG and this technical to get some shots here. Uh, they're crossing the river, and we'll get you guys uh, more forward. Command 6. I think they tried to take a shot. SPG tried to take a shot at the helicopter. Uh, Eagle 2 took contact while moving west from Squad 2's current position. Uh, likely good of enemy forces, Gulf 6, Hotel 6. Okay, so the helicopter took fire from that... Zaki, uh, disregard last. Uh, Fall back Dishka. Until 13, that field. We'll have a Phoenix drop you back in after he's repaired. Squad 4, distant, uh, strike last, go to Hotel 13. Copy. Alright, so 4 is going to go back down the hill and get picked up to move. INS are absolutely making feet towards the bottom here. Making feet. Beating the road. I don't understand what I'm saying. We're gonna, we're gonna ignore that. Bartok and Patrick Star, however, are just sitting here. Patrick's got eyes on this halo, but I would assume he's not gonna take a shot. Squad 1, Inky might be... Patrick might be taking a shot at Inky here. Six, might be some skylining guys here. Please. Shot fired. And the rocket was low. 6-1, having to take some cover here. Enemy fire and rockets up the hill. Uh, where's uh, another rocket? No, we didn't see that one was more on target, but everyone's in cover now. get on the ground with these guys. Phoenix picking up everyone else. Is uh, Patrick going to take a shot at the helicopter? Because I would try. You can see Bartok. Another frag rocket coming in. Overshot. Depaka. Copy. If you can take it down, go for it. Otherwise, just be mindful of it. Three and one work together. 6-1, maybe taking shots at Patrick Star here. Yep. Enemies 300 
areas west of SL1 specifically. Last minute, last minute. We What's saw enemy crossing the 200 GMA meters, 255. Shooting at the hill. I wonder what Patrick's doing right now. Smoke. He's trying to link back up with Bartok. Lant. Short. Interesting tactic there. Why would you use the AT? I guess he... Oh, vanilla AT4 rearmed costs are much, much lower. So he's just gonna rearm. Meanwhile, looks like Patrick and Bartok are gonna roll out here. There's the armor techie. Ines making the west side their castle now. Looks like uh, U.S. forces northeast pretty largely unopposed, even though they reported contact at the radio tower. We're going to fly over there just to see. I'll copy to you. And the helicopter is also well, everyone going for only kills. It's a one life event, so kills are pretty important. <laughs> So yeah, no INS operating east side of the map right now. Everybody over here on the west. There is, I have yeah, a few right here on my location. We're providing 360 now. So south side now in more contact. Matt V is also getting involved now. Technical is directly shooting. Rockets short again. There goes a wheel on the Matt V. That was an SPG shot that overshot. That is a long shot. It's like a click and a half. And he only overshot by like 20 meters. I can't even see the name tag for the guy in the SPG in the SPG techie. Where is he at? There he is. He's in the center of your screen right now. That is tremendous. They're really close. So US is split up two and two. <laughs> INS are really consolidating Fox 9 Hill and Echo 11. Helicopter rolling over top. Oh my god. Helicopter taking fire from the dish technical. As tail hit right there. Much damage being applied. I actually get to see uh, Ines kill right now, so uh, it's four squads? Yeah, we're playing four squads. 36 plus command plus US have a helicopter pilot. I don't think we've had any casualties yet. Bunch of long range engagement here. Oh, no, never mind. That's with like three or four people that just died right there, I think. Depaka gets taken out as well. Matt V moves down, so it's two US down. Very bad. Meanwhile, north... 
These guys aren't taking SPG fire yet. I don't think the SPG is uh, able is able to shoot. Maybe. Uh, there it is. Three, two, one. SPG is actually looking this direction, I think. Three, two, one. Shoot. Something just hit up here. Inus looks like they took a casualty. R2, that's the uh, southwest hill. These guys are just sitting there on top of the hill looking for people to shoot. So far... U.S. playing it pretty slowly, pretty cautiously here, and Honda Hun gets run over. Very cool. R2 got lit up by, I think, an AR there. Making progress now, but looks like some of these guys are taking fire from their north. Yeah, I see the techie. Techie is 255 on the hill falling back. Yeah, it's here. Opposite hill, 285. You see them? There's a lot of them. Yes, we're going to stop and wait for that drop again. We got the gas and then we're going to proceed to. Uh, yeah, 3 to 1. That enemy techie just fell back on the road. They just crashed the hill at Echo 12 1. These guys just skylining like they don't care. So, can we get our engineer to repair our MRAP? Um, Make sure 287. Uh, we don't have. Yep. Down the next ridge, dude, it's really far away. Rocket comes in pretty close. Holy shit. Yeah. Berserker almost died to that. Might have been the SPG. Probably still one rocket shot and we dismount. I think that was the SPG. Let's see if I can find it again. I think the SPG is... Yep, there it is. It definitely took a shot. There is another one short. Shot over. Is it trying to move a little bit? Here comes a shot in. Looks good. Major damage. Baker and bus driver man stand. Shit. Direct hit from the SPG. What a shot. And the supporting infantry Who's on the SPG? So squad Alpha Guido. You are going south to Golf 13. Matt Honcho, any guys you don't want to leave here need to go to Golf 13 time now. We're all getting picked up in the alley. A firm, except for whoever's staying with the MRAP has infantry support. Squad, squad, squad is down. Yeah. Copy. You're gonna get picked up in the heli and we're gonna get in sort of behind enemy lines. The MRAP is gonna stay here and provide just continual base of fire towards the south. Down. Bravo. They're gonna withdraw all the infantry and move them up north. Still taking rounds. Maybe that was uh six one trying to throw a rocket that way. Copy. You and Utopian deal with it as you see fit. US forces now moving on Ali Abad. Would you rather my squad just push west then instead of getting picked up? They need to figure out oh we got a dismount here on the uh, SPG. Might be using his binocs to try to figure out what's going on here. Oh, there's a drone! Alright, I feel like he's gonna go 
here. Captain Morgan using the drone. So U.S. forces withdrawing from the South Hill. All right, go ahead, Ethiopian, for command. Infantry going to get picked up. No, no, command, sorry. Um, um, squad four. A little bit of rebalancing here needs to happen. Squad two to squad four. Squad two to squad four. Uh oh. Four here. Pick up. Uh, pick up the position at Harry nine six seven. Say Henry. Sorry. Oh yeah, Nate. You got square on hit in the right side with an SPG at about a click and a half. SPG was here. You guys were here. It's a click and a half shot. He ranged you guys pretty good. Wait, is Bartok and... Oh, Patrick Star has an R RPG. Do you have a chance to hit this helicopter? Helicopter moving in. Maybe a bit too far for the shot. Maybe actually occluded. Helicopter picking up part of us, part of Inky's squad here. SPG largely abandoned here in the north. Don't sit anyone on it anymore. There's still one squad for U.S. on the South Hill. Uh, five infantry friendly. Gonna drop either at Hotel Six, Golf Six, or Echo Six, depending on what's safest. SPG or the uh, the Mat V is slowly pushing up. There's an SPG attacking to my west side. I don't advise flying. Patrick Star must have run back to try to rearm here. Then we'll, we'll go more north. Bartok got spotted. Looks like. I'm right behind you, sir. Now, boy, boy. Boy. Hello. And Bartek falls off the hilltop. No, he's gonna push back up. Hold, hold, hold. Pretty good fire. She's gonna be like some black and He's dead. He's dead? He's up. He's dead. Pull back, sir. Copy. He's just taking pot shots of these guys. Oh, Matthew's right below me. Tag on it. There it is. Let's see, uh, <laughs> Big Poppy. All right. Let's see what Big's got here. Does he see Bartok? Nice. Oh, Coops is caught out in the open here. Coops got cut out, but he's falling back. Bartok, on the other hand, is just holding observation for Patrick Star. Patrick's moving up. These guys are still on the hill. 
Matt V can't exactly get an angle to shoot these guys, I don't think. And he's being hidden by the trees. Three to command. We probably have two. Meanwhile, the drone has definitely spotted these guys. Alpha has turned his uh, vehicle around. We're going to roll back down. Six. We're going to roll north here and see what is actually happening. Oh, oh no. That was a lat shot on Lori. Lori's dead. They're shooting lats at infantry. Meanwhile, it's basically a squad here on this north hill. Alpha is now shooting frags. RPG is now shooting frag rockets as well to the north. Bow and a bunch of people. Looks like Inky's actually hurt pretty badly. Great positioning here. No one's looking the no INS are looking east. There we go. Ashley and Slasher takes a uh, a round. Ross still not looking to his right. Did you see the tracer coming through? Maybe. Oh, there we go. Now he's trying to find that tracer. Meanwhile, Inus Command throws the drone directly over and Inky gets taken out. SPG. RPG coming through. Short. Or overshot, maybe overshot. Alpha realizes he's being shot at, rolls it back. So US now, three, two and a half squads, northeast side. Means that I or US have to cross the river. We're pushing now. Awesome. Squad three is going to come in behind you, most likely, depending on pilot discretion. Oh, a double kill with the lat rocket. McDavid and Blades go down to uh, Jack 800. And Alpha's repositioned here. Looks like he might be trying to take another shot to the north. Shot over. Oh, he sees these guys exactly where they're at. Rocket comes in. Short. Great effort there by 6-1. What's the response going to be from Alpha? There's the SPG shot. A little bit of lag and a T-pose there from Alpha as he misses by about 20 meters over. And we have a water crossing. Squad 4 under strength squad is now pushing across the river. Pretty unopposed here. Command, I said to be reinserting 3 on the northwest side of the point. Awesome. Meanwhile, we got the Matt V and the infantry squad out of there on the south side. So this is the objective. Fox 1035 is the actual objective they need to go for, I think. It's just a large push here. Multiple squads. Helicopter coming through. Might be bad. Command is down. Command is down. And Bao gets taken out. SPG from range. Alpha probably responsible for that. Uh, it's a low percentage play there trying to climb that north hill. Uh, your current position. You gotta go all the way up the mountain for that to work. I think that's actually blocked off. I... Let's get a reset on what's going on here. Try to land somewhere south side of the floor or maybe south. Oh, we got actually fighting on the hill as four is underneath. So force fighting uphill here. Six copies. Score one, no comms. Copy. Zaki 
shooting uphill now. Squad three land. Um, land squad three help you to take out the waypoint. Zero minus with the Mosin. Very dumb. Someone should have checked that. Pretty sure we banned the Mosin for vanilla ops. What server is this? Uh, this is a one life event that is open to the public, but at this time it's closed. We run these events based on our website, squadops.gg. So this isn't a server you could just join in here. What's it? That Brad dude gets shot up. The cheese man takes a rocket, silence gonna run straight for Audacity here. Might have seen him. He knows someone's around here. He might have actually seen that Brad dude go down. Audacity and Silent Death just on the other side of the hill. Lots of foliage concealing. Audacity opens up, Silent's gonna take them out. We definitely have a bunch of servers. Uh, I don't know if any are popped right now, because probably a lot of people are taking involved in, in the operation. Audacity made a move and Silent saw it. Oh, another multi-kill rocket! U.S. out in the open, not moving fast enough to make take advantage of any sort of deployment here. And they're just getting shredded. Squad 4 providing support as they move up a hill. Not gonna happen. Grenades. Helicopter gonna try to get in there. Have, have them as your gunner if you want. That might help. Just was saying, just like real life? I don't know. Command, mean, follow the channel. Thank you so much. Copy. Austin, think about getting the game? Hey, what we're doing and what a pub server is like is completely different. are completely different things. But... Uh, they're trying to shoot the helicopter, I think. Helicopter is taking fire. And that was the last shot. Looks like it's going to be a miss. Think about getting it's Is it worth it if it's been out there? I definitely think it's worth. If you remember what PR was, it's very, uh, very, very spiritually reminiscent of that. Minus all the BF2 standalone mod jank. Very focused on combat. You need to have a good squad lead, that's true. Pub servers, you kinda you kinda take the roll of the dice. Now this is a one life event where we have rules and stuff. Um, so it's a little bit different than a pub game. All of our SLs are vetted. And part of the community. So they sort of have, they sort of know what we're going for and know what to expect. Stand by. How long is the game? Hour and a half tops. Two hours tops, usually. Now there is some RPG fire on this hill. Thinks what I saw. What was that? Thank you. U.S. just not making effort. Zach got killed. Or Jack got killed. Command six. I can confirm at least one times HMG Techie on that mountain. We took fire when picking up the remnants of Squad One. Copy. Got the man V on the road here, and it looks like the guys on the south hill are now moving north. SBG is just shooting at people on top of the hill. How do you join the server? Squadops.gg gets you started. Um, this is all a private event. 
but we hold them regularly. SPG overshots Kanan. Is he trying to? Squad three. Who's he shooting at? Go ahead and Maybe he's trying to shoot at the H or the SPG tech and he's missing. Yep. So the Discord first and sign up on our website, get you started. You can join open ops without basic. Just watch our calendar for when we have events scheduled and stuff like that. Usually run events 1.30, uh, 13.30, uh, 13.45 rather, Eastern time on Saturdays. And then 20.30 on, um, 20.45 rather, on weeknights and weekends. It's kind of crazy right now. US is pretty fragmented, but they do have a a line. The problem is they just have to fight INS over all of these hills. It's not exactly going their way. INS have all the hilltops that matter. Cross side of the rock, on top of the rock, yeah, the left side door. of the hill. RPG's coming in. I don't think that was... It looks like they may have ditched the SPG techie. Because Alpha's not running with anything now. Man, these fucking sons of bitches trying to hit me. Zaki gets tagged. On the hill! 324, 324! Across the road. Saw Alpha. I'm starting to try to make some push here. Helicopter's still up. It's taking some damage, but it's fine. Come to me. Come to me. Moving. Get down. Zaki made it out of there after taking looks like two shots. Oh, they just shot a rocket over there. I think two SWAT. Echo nine, Echo eight. Alpha's just running. Up on the hill. That. Still taking light fire. They're still shooting frag rockets up the hills. Ooh boy. I think Silent saw Alpha here. Uh, yeah, I think Silent saw Alpha. Yep, he saw him again. Alpha prone straight into the field. Now Thailand's getting shot. Grenade throw? Might be too far. Not far enough, actually. I'm not even sure what part of the patrol is right now. Uh, what the objective is. Oh no, Dishkateki nails the gunner. Helicopter flying over it has been shot multiple times now and is smoking. What is Squad 2 doing? Why are they not moving? Utopian, it must be command stunned. Command 6, up to gun 2 times enemy technicals. Echo 8 8, as well as Charlie 9 8. Echo 8 8, Echo eight, eight, eight. Charlie 9 8. US hard pressed to find the numbers, and they're not pushing with urgency here. 
INS getting all the time in the world to find the hill they want to sit on for when they come for when US comes up and over theirs. There's a tree and then there's a bush. Some people are making progress of their own, but they're not supported. Oh, I'm getting killed. Yeah, we'll try to get an RPG, uh, AT4 in there. Look at this position for INS, though. Uh, this is what you want to be. Partox get a Mosin as well? Wow, that's funny. I thought Mosins were banned. Maybe they weren't. I mean, heck, I'd be running Mosin if I could. Mosin's strong. Army Soul, take a look and see what he can find here. He knows their infantry sitting on that hill. I think the helicopter is just a distraction at this point. Dishka taking a few pot shots at the helicopter. Is the Albarber and Dishka very strong? Why ban the Mosin? It's one shot, one kill. Basically. It's just, it's just pretty strong. And it's a one life event. So. I don't know. That's just my opinion. I probably wouldn't have it in a, we usually take out the Mosin for our mod, but we're not running the mod today. So this could just be a, uh, a mod thing. The U.S. moving in on a compound here. Potentially an objective. So is Alpha with the SPG. That's why he's not on it anymore. He probably used all the rounds on it. Schizophrenic puts a few puts a round into Rex Leon there, and now Hanu's covering. Even Thanosaurus. <laughs> Defying uh, human mechanics by laying down and shooting up. Polo takes a shot as he runs into the compound. It's just Honu left. Thanosaurus. Ooh! Billy the Kid goes down. INS starting to lose concentration in the south, but they still have all of the uh, the height advantage here, the elevation. Meanwhile, INS in the north holding out pretty strong here. Even Utopian's making a play for the North Hill. And as I say that, Killer J goes down. Very rough position for these U.S. guys pushing these fields. Helicopter flying over, taking shots. I see red lights. Helicopter on fire. Has to bug out. Command 6, Eagle 2 is going down. Copy. Yep, and there it is. He's not going to have much time left. He's got to find a way to land that quickly. And almost makes it. He's coming in pretty fast for that landing anyway. I think it would have not been well for him. So I think U.S. called mission objective complete here in Fox 1077. And they're falling north. They're rolling into Echo 9-9. Squad and the half size force now converging on this for U.S. U.S. have a vehicle? No, they ditched it. 
I don't think U.S. have another vehicle left. So it's just plain infantry ground pounding on the way out. North of us. Meanwhile, looks like a uh, snowman, snowmansky. We have squad three back up behind us to ourselves. Yep, yeah, that's why we're here. We get shot up, so. That's not nice. us. That's our. That's our dude shooting. Oh shit, my bad. Silent makes it across the river. Yo, they're in the water bed, boys. Do we Under need the to bridge. clear the Yes, we have to clear. Well, don't have to clear the compound. You have to clear the area. Grenade? Uh, maybe not. Copy that. RPG. Oh, maybe that was a friendly? Oh, I saw a technical take a big leap down. Oh, it's a motorcycle. Patrick Star and Bartok the war Bartok Warrior. That's kind of brutal. If they know US have stalled out here, taking this hill would be very bad. There's still plenty of US off the point, and I think Morgan has a I, uh, Morgan has a drone. Yeah, I think I think exactly what's going on here. Lat rocket goes in, and main Casey, Kane and Casey, and JKR go down immediately. Patrick loads another rocket. I think Rex is not long for this world. Rex gets shot before Patrick can line up a shot. Patrick with a frag rocket has all the time in the world. Zaki, Curry need to hurry up, and the rest of the squad two up north need to make a move. They're taking too long coming up the hill. Rockets coming in now from multiple directions. U.S. are in a bad position. And the only way out is the north guys have to make a play fast. I don't think there's any communication for what's going on here. Trust in Destroyer, Schizophrenic. Running straight at these guys. Does Polo see them? Polo saw them. Dresden goes down. Thanosaurus keeping his situational awareness. Polo's gonna sneak up behind Schizophrenic here. Rocket goes in, and there goes Polo. Patrick Star gets another kill with the frag rocket. I think that's all the ammo Patrick's got for his RPG. Bartok goes down east side rock. It's just four US remain five US remaining in the fields down below. Ina slowly slowly tightening the noose. But uh US still have support off the point. Zaki and Curry making way you trying to use all of that's a grenade. Hey, yo. I think they know these guys are over here. They're throwing grenades. They're getting close. I think someone's just rearming and throwing all the grenades they can. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening. I think one of them's coming this way. Uh, Ash Linging Slasher and Legar in a fight now. Ash crawls down to some death laid. So the bridge is the next objective. Alright, two. There should be contact to the south of you, west of Foy, on the hill. Uh, silent, just saw them. Here we go, Utopian and a fire team with support. Stream movie, did you buy the game? Welcome to the community, man. Hop into the Discord and uh, take a look, man. We've got a few servers up. There's a bunch of servers that really focus on the uh, the gameplay and the in the team play for sure. Meanwhile, Hashling and Slasher. Uh, <laughs> Two people confirmed kill. Nice. Killed Zaki from. Zaki and Curry got Ashley and Slasher from behind. 
think he was trying to make a way around this building. Discord link, discord.gg slash squad ops. Couldn't be simpler. Oh. Oh, no. There goes Juventus. Gets shot out of the technical. The technical rolls back down. But Bong gets out of the technical first. And is able to kill Alkaline. Nashville. Takes a peek, but Bong gets out of there. Or gets shot up by Cartel, it looks like. Polish now hiding under the technical. <laughs> yeah, everyone here is just gonna keep their heads down until... Nashville covering. There goes Polish. Copy. So that's the technical isolated for INS. Elvito and Scoopa Rob now rolling up the hill. Grenade for good measure, of course. This map over this hill. The armored techie. Careful, watch this flank here. And Echo 996. Yeah, it's taking five. Yep, so that's the riverbed. So, four around the riverbed, two up the hill here. Anyone else still alive? Not that I can tell. Oh, behind, actually. There's another tentacle! 6 1 gets lit up from behind. How to play this game mode? Squad, you gotta join our Discord and play one of these organized games. This is uh, something we organize, it's not an actual game mode. Oh no, Ewok is in the partner techie. He's looking for things to do. Lagar has no rounds, otherwise that thing would definitely be hit by now. And if he stands up for a second, Ewok's gonna zero on him. Matt Honcho. They gotta secure these bridges. Kimchi, Mr. Toaster, Fisco, stopping that from happening, along with Patrick Star now coming in from the east. Thanosaurus. What is he trying to do here? Keep himself hidden. US still have folks up here. Morgan's actually moving to contact. Does Zaki see Morgan crawling on the, the hill? Might see him now. Squad 3, there is enemy contact alert inside E964. Curry and uh, Zaki take out INS Command. He, he's dead, he's dead. Right, he's right. dead. Down to five INS. US need to link up. Nice hit. Nice hit. Nice hit. Five INS. Six INS, actually. Kugel actually gets dropped. Thanosaurus goes down as he rolls straight towards the objective. Might have gotten shot from behind. I got the guy through the nade. Got me. All right, we have a guy. Fisco. Southwest at Echo 9. Popped by Echo Silent Death. Flat. I'm all yellow and ammo. Did you, did you kill the, uh, the techie guy, Lagar? The techie's still up. Right. Oh, he's down. Cool. He walked out off the gun, but I think Kugel was over there. This is the last point. We have to sweep and clear this area. Copy. Hey, this is going to push point. south. I'll push south. Patrick's got a brilliant position. I'll just wait for the other guys. As soon as he pushes the corner, he's going to have excellent visibility on anyone trying to stand up in this field. Kind of hard to tell. U.S. really need to push south now. Squad 4, I'm going to push to the building at E979. They really need to push south. Through that building to the west of Squad 3. West of Squad 3. Copy, I'm trying. Play of contact west side of this river. Still not clear. Patrick Star making a move. Nobody has eyes on Matt actually making a big push up to get to the riverbed. I know he's always been there. Now Patrick Star cutting up the cutting up the uh, road now. 
Hurry up. Hey, I see you right now. Oh, Patrick started taking shots. Yep, you don't lie. Where's I you? Kimchi and Mr. Toast are just hiding, looking up for these guys coming up from the North Hill. U.S. starting to push past. Scuba Rob has actually got a great position overlooking everything. Zaki may have seen Ewok. Yeah, Matt. I think we're getting stuff from the southeast side. I think he saw Ewok. No, he's looking. He's got his binox up. Patrick Star actually made it all the way around to the techie. He's trying to link up with Ewok. Smart play. May have actually rearmed his rockets. He's loading the frag. Bad news for US. Scuba actually crawls past everyone. And uh, rocket coming in. Zach, you got caught up in the hill. To our east, JJ. You clear those fields to our west by the bridge. Uh, we should have it secured. Oh, look at that. Patrick starts on a roof. Lat going in towards the river. Lagar got caught out. He's just taking them out one by one. Patrick Star loading another rocket. Shot. Looks like a miss. Oh, no. Toaster point blanks Utopian. Nashville runs over Toaster. Kimchi's dead. From behind, Toaster misses. Nashville not able to find Toaster in the field. He goes down. It's just Lib now pushing in from the east. Or from the west. Silent and Honcho still on the point. Patrick Starr and Ewok still off. I think Curry's still up here on the hill. Lib has got to find Toaster. Silent may have spotted him. Rocket goes in. Honcho gets hit pretty hard. I think he's down. Silent Jukes Toaster out for a shot. Single shot. You gotta rush him. Rocket goes in. It's Silent is dead. Oh my god. It's Scuba Rob. Scuba getting shot up from the hillside. Curry making shots. But Curry not able to take it out. Scuba Rob gets it, but he just got hit. And now, technically, Liberal is on the point by himself. A little bit of miscommunication here. I think Patrick just shot a rocket up the hill there. He walked right in front of Lib. Come on, Lib. Just waiting for the right time to take the shot. Might actually not see him very well. He's in a bush. Uh, scoop of Rob coming in from the west side. Might actually get Lib here if he's not careful. Ewok looking around. Sees Lib. And that's it. Three INS remain at the end of the round. And that's GG. Oh boy.